Good morning. Yeah, this is the breakfast of champions. Diet sun drop. They don't make that in Maryland, huh? No. And that's one of the benefits of being here. Oh, our fancy fridge. I just locked it. Why did you lock it for? I don't know. I just hit it with my... I'm just kidding. This I don't know what it means. Lock, hold three seconds. I don't That'll know. cause you to diet. Okay, hold on. Yeah. Lori's new way of dieting. Lock Wait, the refrigerator. How do you... I don't know. It says Turn. unlock. Though. See, it's like unlock. Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Get this, get the video. Wait, <laughs> hang on on the video. You, so, I was videoing Dustin's Matt, in Tom, my oh, shoulder. Wait, 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 Calibrate measure options. still. Press options. Options. Oh. No one ain't doing it. I think because the door is open. I don't care. Go to options. No, stop, 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 stop. Ah! <laughs> You locked our fridge. I guess my shoulder hit it for three seconds. You're locking it. Oh, you unlocked it. <laughs> Diet over. <laughs> Happy Monday. Where where are our children? Sold them. Yep. <laughs> they That's are. what I say about everything. I sold it. Kids hate that. Where's the dog at? Sold it. Where's my toothbrush? Sold it. Where's my favorite blanket? Sold it. That never goes over well. <laughs>anything that I want to hold on to. Let it go, let it go. <laughs> that would like hold on to girls. like my sanity or dignity or anything like that and I'm just gonna be authentic. Authentic. And show you guys what our house really looks oh, like. Oh geez, here it comes guys. It's bad. bad. So turn it around the other way. So I'm going to. It. That's not a good view. Let's yeah it is goes. because this is what it is. So this is our goal today. We have to go to the bank and set up a new account. Yeah, give them a look at my banking clothes. Yeah. This is me <laughs> saying, hey, don't Don't get cocky. And this is my painting pants oh, with yeah. holes in them. And okay. I'm just saying, hey, look at me. You need to give me a bank account. We have to go to the bank. I have to go to Staples because I ordered something to be printed because I have a CC meeting tomorrow. But then I promise you, 10 minutes after I pressed send and they're printing it for me, I found the cord to my printer. But, so we have to go pick that up and we are going to try to get all of the boxes in the living room into storage and bring in couch and... Yeah. At least getting like the that. boxes out and everything clear so I can paint. And you guys have seen, I can paint a room in a day or quicker. So I can paint a couple rooms in a day. If I can knock out that room and this room, we can have living space open. Then it's bathrooms, then it's kitchen. And bathrooms can take a little longer because you can use them in the middle of the mix. But these living spaces now are very important. We need to do our dinner time devotions again. We've had to put them on pause in this house because just not quite possible. <laughs> There's so. like a raccoon. But we do have our table. We got our table back. We were going to leave it behind and guess what? We got to bring it with us. They already saw that. Anyway, so then all that stuff needs to go because we need space for the kids, especially when they wake up, to come out and just hang out. Our kids get up at like 6 in the morning, so... I ain't wanting to babysit at six in the mornings. And you Just don't. Just being honest. No, I don't. I don't. It was like seven twenty-three this morning. Well, that's not bad, but still, you know, I have been up a lot of mornings and evenings. Okay. Okay. And I goodbye. Need some... Goodbye. Bye bye. Can you guys see our view? That just makes it all worth it. Isn't that really pretty? Yeah, coffee and the view, man. That makes it weird. When I turn around and look at this other view, I can survive. <laughs> okay, we did not sell our children. No. Um, we did give them to Dustin's mom. Yep. She came and picked them up this morning. Every Monday she goes to the retirement home and does ministry there. And so Malachi gets his uh, cheeks pinched and Lydia does her thing. And yep. Anna helps with arts and crafts and prays for them. And Anna said... They get to minister to these folks at this retirement community. And it's not just practice. It's good life for these kids yeah. to do ministry. 
And Anna said, you know, I feel so bad because this one lady, she keeps falling asleep and this other lady keeps talking to me and I don't know what she's saying, but. And I want to shout out that this is, this goes out to mom and Miss Kathy. Miss yeah. Kathy actually used to be, so Kathy Moore, she used to be one of the folks that ran around and did youth with me when I was in youth group. Aww. Yep. And so that. her kids were in youth with me. Yeah, Kevin and Luann. And so we grew up together. We had a blast doing dramas and stuff like that. And now she's running around with mom doing this thing with the kids. And so it's like, that's just cool. That's cool. Yeah. Okay, and then one more thing. And we really do have to go because we're kind of wasting our time without children because mm -hmm. we need to be getting some stuff done. I apologize officially for calling you a jerk on Friday. As being a jerk. <laughs> I take it back <laughs> at the very end of the vlog on Friday if you didn't watch it go back and watch it but it was family second Jesus first and I was like, jerk jerk <laughs> but our precious <clears throat> precious two-year-old fell on his head yeah. on concrete under his supervision and he had the audacity to think I was insane for no. wanting to take him to the ER because he had a knot the shape of I my finger think, right there. I didn't think she's insane. I picked her up, I picked him up and I was praying for him and um, and just had him and he had not fallen straight on his head. So you give him 30 minutes at tops and if it had been any higher, we would have taken him. But it was just one of those things where we need to watch him and if he had a concussion that's different he did not he was just fine he woke up next morning but and he only runs sideways like this <laughs> dustin wasn't being super friendly with me he wasn't having compassion that i was freaking out no he no hang didn't on i think i needed hang to on. freak out at all wayne chapman was it's, backing me up it's wayne concrete. chapman was backing me up her dad was on my when team when you're a baby hits his head <laughs> on concrete you no. go to the er that's no. the rule no 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 there's that's oh, not the rule. we need to let it go. Let it go. Let it go. <laughs> but I felt bad because that was like our first um, name calling on the vlog. Yeah, because we only do it when the video camera's off usually. <laughs> no, that's, you guys, you're seeing it. This is, that's pretty much the extent of our fighting. So, yeah, we don't yell, we don't, we don't curse, we don't do all that kind of stuff. We call each other jerk and nerd and dork. moron and dork. I don't say moron. Say I do. Right. Moron's meant as a loving term. I used to be a moron. <laughs> okay, we really have to go. Okay. Okay, you might not Fine see any more God. of us today until the end when I show you. Oh, wow. No, you'll oh, see this. On. We gotta show them what happens. A couch right there somewhere. And those Wait, I got gosh pink. awful pink things gone. Don't say gosh. Gosh is a bad Goodness word. awful. Yeah, the kids are gonna be like, give me a quarter, mom. Okay, goodbye. Bye. Lori is turning ourselves around because we just saw the Time Warner van out at our neighbor's house. Our neighbor who's about 350, 400 yards away from our house, when Time Warner said they would not give us cable. No, they would give us cable. They would give us cable, but the quote for me to bring the cable into my house was $37,000. And I am not making that up. That's their actual number. I'm not lying. I don't lie about this stuff. It's too weird to lie. My life is that unbelievable, which you should know by now. United Airlines is trying to figure out how that happened. But anyways, so with that said, we are running out. I'm going to try to accost, not accost, but I want to accost <laughs> this Time Warner van because it's parked at my neighbor's house and he, they've got cable. And that means we could have high speed internet and we could be doing better Would stuff you with you guys. Get the vlogs faster. You should be angry at Time Warner. Anyways, so we're trying to get a hold of them because we need faster internet because we are struggling to get anything up. So um, I'm going out here to talk to this guy and see what the world is going on and figure out why we don't have cable when our neighbors right here, same driveway, have it. All right, so we just hung out with the technician from Time Warner Cable, I won't say name because I don't want to put anybody on record. And he said, our neighbors do have Time Warner. They all have it. They all have cable internet access and they're all on it. Time Warner lied to me and said that I would have to get all of them on Time Warner Cable and it would cost $37,000 and we could try to split it and finance it. They all have it already. And I'm only literally a few hundred yards 
down the hill and if they've pulled it this mile in to get to them then they should pull it a couple hundred yards to get it to me unbelievable so he told us where to go at the local office and even like go to the girl with blonde hair who's sitting at the this the, the desk and i'll yep. text her right now and tell her you're coming and he hooked us up so he he sent it over we're gonna meet with her with the local office and then hopefully we can get this internet now i still have satellite internet and I will, all I'll do is I'll turn it down to the lowest speed and keep it as backup. It's perfect. I want backup because what the work I do, I need backup. But man, we might have internet. And I'll tell you something. I will buy cable if it gets me internet, but we're not watching it. We'll just turn it off and pay for it if I can. I just need internet so badly. We went to Time Warner's office. We just met with... Um, a good person there who we're given the name of she's which we're not going to share she's very nice she said she I need we were coming yep. so the guy said what he, he was he did what he said they gave me a number they said i need to call construction because they did do a survey but she said i need to go after them dc style because it should not cost thirty-seven thousand dollars. and she said they lied when they said my neighbors didn't have it my neighbors do have it and we need to go after them and get them to give us a better price in essence, they just didn't want to pull it out there to that, probably that double wide you guys know we're living in for the next while. And they probably didn't see it as a going concern as far as finance, even though there are all kind of clauses if you break early, we'd have to pay, but it's the way it is. So we're gonna have to fight a little bit and possibly pay a little money. We'll see what happens. We gotta run around today a little bit. So we still haven't made it to get our bank account set up, but look at this, got my glass windows so that I can fix the windows on the house. Now they've taken a couple weeks extra and it's been really weird, but they called me while I was in transit, back and forth, Charleston, Atlanta stuff going on, believe it or not. And I go in and I gotta tell you the story here in a second of what happened with the lady inside for these windows. I go in and the lady just looks at me and she says, I'm so sorry, I'm having one of those Mondays. And I said, don't we all? And aren't we all having one of those Mondays? And she goes, no. I'm trying to help a friend. I've been working through his process. He's had a real bad remodel on his um, bathroom and he's just been attacking me all day because I'm the last step on the whole thing. The remodel's been tough on him, but you know, the glass panels came, they're cut wrong. She goes, it's one, one small thing that we've had an issue with. We've had no other issues. But for him, it's like everything and it comes down on us. So he's blowing up at me and she goes, and the devil's just using this to attack me. She goes, the devil has a way of using those people against you and your very own friends and the devil has a way of just da da da. She says, whatever. And then before I could even think, I said, you know what though? Let me just tell you. The thing I understand is that God is in control of all of it. And since you said the devil's attacking you, I'm gonna go after the Jesus side. So here's what's going on. We need to understand that what Satan means for evil, God will use for our good. And that no matter what this is or what it looks like, I believe in the name of Jesus Christ, this is gonna turn around for you. And she goes, oh my goodness, thank you so much. I hope so. And I said, you hope so. Let me tell you a real quick thing. And I said, I didn't tell her the whole story. All I said is, I just spent a trip that I was supposed to go to Atlanta and going to Charleston. And in like two sentences told her what happened. She's like, that's unbelievable. I said, sounds impossible. Well, I just prayed for eight people on that trip who specifically said, you know, God literally sent you to pray for me. I needed this. This was God. And she goes, that is unbelievable. I have cold chills. And I said, right? Sounds impossible. Only one person does the impossible. His name is Jesus Christ. It's on purpose. That was a bad experience. Trust me. God turned it into an amazing adventure. In the name of Jesus Christ, he's going to turn us around for an adventure. She's like, oh my God, I needed to hear that. Thank you so much. I got cold chills. Her hair stand up. She's like, you know, praise God. And I said, amen. All right. I'll see you. Have a good one. Keep, keep, keep on fire. Don't let this steal your fire and your faith. She's like, I needed this today. Thank you so much. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. Okay, I swapped hats. I can find my old one. We're in here. We're getting this stuff taken care of. We have a Bank of America bank account so I can get deposits from my 714 Consulting easily. We have the glass windows that we needed, and we have run around Tarnation. We still got more Tarnation running around to do. We are clearing out that room, and I'm going to show you how that's going here in just a second. The kids are back in. You'll see them running through. They had a great time over at the gardens with um, with Yaya, 
and Miss Kathy, and um, they're just playing. They love their space, even though this place is a wreck. But we are changing that today. And the address it says, Dear Miss Hedrick, thank you for contacting YoPlay regarding strawberry splash and berry blue blast. Bla bla that's not fair. <laughs> berry blue blast gogurt. We understand your concern and are sorry you had this experience. Packages are formed and filled automatically at great speed and a continuous operation. A malfunction of the equipment may have been responsible for this improper packaging. Please be assured that our quality department has been notified of your report. We apologize for any inconvenience you experience and appreciate the opportunity for, to reply to your concerns. And da da da. Boom. Thank there it is. You, and then, boom. Look at those. Woohoo. One like, of them's a $4, like $4 off any box. Yeah. And then there's a couple, like a little bit off if I want to buy a discount. Yeah. So we are buying that. That's very cool. So, yay. All right. So I just got off the phone with Time Warner Cable serviceability and contractors and whatever and they said they were not aware that everyone had the internet and cable all the way down my road and so they're looking at it again and I told them do you think it's gonna cost thirty seven thousand four hundred dollars this time and they said well you know now that we we aren't showing billing showing up for your neighbors I said I assure you you should be billing them because they had a technician at their house uh, they've been paying it's just they're not showing up I said I was at their house talking to the technician personally we've got video of them in their driveway and they're like oh okay well is it the beginning of the road I said no the middle so long story short they're working on it we're gonna see if we can get uh, Time Warner cable and hopefully that's gonna be finished up real soon Lori saying she's tired because we've had a long day we've been boxing stuff up getting bank accounts getting things moved taking care of all these issues, picking up glass. Now we're getting the kids to Yaya's house. And um, I just wanted to say that I got off the phone with a couple different um, calls with corporate with United Airlines as they fully figured out what in the world just happened and they're sending me to Charleston, which they say, which they say never happens and is, a, is an impossibility. They figured out through documentation that I've done with them that it did happen and they said very clearly, we are in the wrong, we are taking ownership, we're gonna make this right, we are so sorry. They're giving me a flight voucher so I, I can either take Lori or anyone I want and fly somewhere. Yeah, it's her. And then, <laughs> and then they're giving me mileage back, they've already taken care of everything else and they said if there's anything else that they can do for me, just let them know. And there's nothing else, I'm so happy. And so we called it at that, but they are really making good on everything because of this special right here. <laughs> so they kept calling me the special. <laughs> are where are we, kiddos? Yaya's yeah, yeah, again. You can go, Yaya. Yeah, yeah. You can go, Yaya. Yeah, yeah. Here we are again. This load is going into storage and we're gonna take a few things back with us, but not much. It is hot, but we finished. We have Malachi's train table. I have my foundations guide for my first tutor meeting tomorrow with the new school. And that only took 16 minutes. I'm so shocked. That was, it was, we're done. So anyways, oh, now, back to unloading. I don't know if this process is ever, ever, ever going to end. We didn't record it because we didn't know it'd be a good deal, but we finished up loading over at our storage. We're going to Walmart. We ended up at Big Lots and guess what? We found our shelves we need that we're going to use to actually kind of create a separate space and a little closet and a break. 
you're gonna see how it works but we're creating this really cool space in the um, house instead of a walkthrough since we have two entries to the master bedroom we're creating one and kind of you know locking it off and at and the we're same blocking time, a doorway with we're two blocking a doorway, but we're creating a closet. Not like we need any more. We have tons more than the old house, but we're creating bookshelves and book space. And also we're creating some separation for our room. And it's going to be kind of interesting. We'll see. It's because Malachi learned how to open that door. And Dustin doesn't want them coming in. I want space. <laughs> I want my space back. <laughs> Finishing up the night. We had dinner over at mom's after doing all our errands and getting all our stuff. House is getting in order. We're gonna jump back on tomorrow. And after that, um, you guys will see hopefully paint on all the main walls and a living room set up. But with that said, it's time to crash. So don't forget, keep family second and Jesus first. <laughs> Being a jerk, as being a jerk, as being a jerk.